At the New Relationship Trust, we want to highlight the importance of investing in employees' health and wellness. At NRT, we believe in the power of health and wellness benefits for our employees. These benefits not only improve overall well-being, but also enhance productivity, job satisfaction, and community engagement. That is why we want to share this video as it showcases the benefits of investing in employee health while highlighting our successful partnerships. We will now meet Alan and Deidre who support our organization and foster healthy, respectful work environment. A number of years ago, a very well-known international consultancy did a survey and they surveyed employees from uh, European countries as well as North America, the United States and Canada. In the survey, they asked one question and that was, what was it about their relationship with their employer that they cared about the most? And something in the order of 74% of the respondents to this survey said that the most important element in their relationship with their employer is that they know that their employer cares about them as people. Working with the insurance companies, they tend to be kind of rigid in their design of benefit plans and they take a lot of time to catch up with the times. However, we are seeing uh, more and more solutions available in the marketplace that enhance benefits for different groups. I've been working with uh, First Nations uh, organizations for over 25 years. My work with the First Nations group started in the very remote areas up at the northern coast of BC. And one of the things that I found during my time there was that there was a lot of traditional healing going on in the communities that was very helpful. What we're seeing that's very exciting is that there's a move with insurance companies that are incorporating more of these needs of Indigenous people and traditional healing within their benefit plans. And in particular when it comes to mental health. And mental health is a very difficult thing uh, to adjudicate as far as determining whether a person is disabled or not or able to function in their normal job. And they're willing now to look at the fact that First Nations people have century-old remedies that they know will work for them and the insurance companies are realizing that they can run in partnership, so to speak, with the Western medications and Western ways of treating mental illness and, uh, and other illnesses as well and pair that with the traditional healings of the First Nations people. It's been very exciting to see our industry expanding in terms of the kinds of things that can be included under these types of wellness plans.